أكبر In his sermon shortly after the two rakats, Modibo Mustafa Abu Bakr tags Muslim faithfuls on total submissions to the will of Allah. He says they should ensure visitations and cementing of good ties between relatives, friends which may include others from another religion. <laughs> Shortly after the two rakats, the pantizing who is also the Yiranko Mumwe, Suleiman Ibrahim Sambo, called on his subjects to thank Allah for bringing them yet to another Eid al-Fitri celebration. He says the clarion call of the Taraba state governor, which emphasizing on peace, should strictly be adhered to. It is my duty as a pantizing, the ability to all of you here, more especially my GCD heads, village heads, world heads, and elders to all. The paramount ruler decried the situation where those he contested the throne with, among whom were close relatives who took the matter to the court that later gave him victory to join hands with him to build the emirate and calls for total cooperation amongst them. This is the first time in the history of Zin where contestants of the same family took their brother to court simply because the electoral college have elected him. I don't know which electoral college they want them to elect him so as to agree and comply with the election. I it will be recalled that Ibrahim Suleiman Sambo emerged Amir when his predecessor died in the Hajj stampede of 2015. Similarly, the chief imam of Madagali, Modibo Ahmadu Dairu, thanked Allah for a successful Ramadan and of course the restoration of security and peace in Gulag throughout the Ramadan. Modibo Ahmadu Dairu praised Allah to bring lasting peace to the community. He says everything that happened in the last few years were act of Allah in testing the tawakal of his creatures. <laughs> The district head of Gulak, Al Haji Bello Tsimda, echoed the assertion of the cleric and calls for collective effort in achieving total peace in the community. He thanked Allah for the completion of the Ramadan. Uh, people are uh, to reunite themselves more than as before to make sure that they stay peacefully with uh, each another to see that uh, these things that have happened have happened and it have passed. Responding, the chairman of Madagali local government area, Yusuf Mohamed, says despite the fact that his council is prone to security challenges, he demands for vigilance from all in identifying bad eggs. Thank God that uh, we are celebrating Salah without any problem. The security situation of the local government is calm. We are grateful to the Lord. We are grateful to our security men. And we are grateful to the good people of the local government. I am uh, uh, calling on our people to be law abiding. Be law abiding. Whatever. They should be vigilant in terms of security and other Madagali remains the worst hit out of the seven consuls that were overrun by Boko Haram until they were liberated by the Nigerian army. Abdraman Abakar, 2-6 News.